We are starting our summer walk and pub trail around Iron Bridge here at the All Nations Inn now. And uh, yes, the weather is very, very hot for this time in the UK. From here, we'll be going on a three hours walk past other pubs, museums, and uh, lots of um, pretty landscape, hopefully. <laughs> The weather in the UK, you wouldn't even believe it. <laughs> yep, guys, say hi to my partner Adrian and to our friend Mia <laughs> for indulging me today. <laughs> and Mia, who's local, told me uh, some fun stuff about these all of these uh, big structures that we encounter in the way. Mia has just told me what uh, these uh, big uh, bridges, uh, built structures uh, used to be for. Apparently, um, the trucks that were carrying uh, the uh, coal ore down uh, from, from the mines, uh, they worked on a cable system and um, the loaded one will go down the slope and then it will pull up uh, the empty truck and that's how it all worked. And yes, just here behind me is one of the build structures that uh, the trucks will go onto. <laughs> now that's a hat contest. <laughs> I hope this little stop uh, and insert was geeky enough for all my geeky followers who are just as geeky as I am, probably, hopefully, because now I think we are going to go straight to a pub and not really stop that much anymore because uh, I might just drive Mia and Adrian crazy. So just behind me, Mia was pointing just a minute ago for me to come down here because you can see the actual uh, lines where the trucks will uh, go down the slope. So uh, here we are at the first canal where actually uh, the trucks will unload their ore onto the barges. and it smells absolutely gorgeous. So yes, this is going to be our next pit stop. On such a day, apparently, there is about an hour and a half wait for food, but we are only going to get some drinks. I drank half of my martini rosso and lemonade on the way down through the garden to find a suitable spot to sit, uh, part shade, part sunshine, by the riverbank. 
Uh, this is actually more lemonade than martini, unfortunately, but yeah, it will do. So if I've got this right, if I've understood from Mia, this is Maydee and this is mm -hmm. where we started the pub, yeah. which is opposite the Blisters Hill mm -hmm. Mining Museum, and we walked all the way down that path, yeah. and then we saw the tar, tar tunnels. We went all along here. Oh, along the, the Siskin Way, yes, along the back. And then we saw the tar tunnels somewhere around there. Yeah. And then we've gone, oh, that's the bridge we went yeah, over, and the there's the pub that we, we just stopped at, that was once a hippie pub. Yeah. Yeah. These buildings here, as we walking through Severn Valley, used to be the miners' cottages. So here we are, past the miners' cottages, in what used to be a Victorian tile factory. We're going to have another stop here for some ice cream. Well, it is uh, needed today. Unfortunately, we didn't find any ice cream in the tea room and I had lots of cake at the weekend. But I'm still going to take you inside because it's really, really pretty here. In what used to be this old Victorian tile factory, now there's lots of art galleries, which one day I will take you back to and we can see more of maybe. We are going to speed up now this way because it's a little bit late, a little bit later than uh, we factored in. I was going to show you this on our walk today, then gone straight in the middle of uh, our trail, but, but apparently the bridge at Iron Bridge is under renovation. So I can just show you a little bit. Around it. I was going to show you Iron Bridge the birthplace of the Industrial Revolution uh, today, but uh, what you can see behind me is the actual bridge uh, go undergoing renovation. At the end of our walk today, I'm just going to show you a bit around and uh, it seems like what we planned uh, to be one whole walk with all the recording, it will turn into two walks. The other half for next time then. We are now literally just hunting for a pub somewhere to eat because uh, it's been a few hours since we started and just by the Malt House pub there's like a b, b with apparently really nice rooms if anybody's interested to spend uh, some time over here in uh, Ironbridge. Not sure if we are going to stop at the Malt House but apparently at the weekend they have live bands here this might be it for our meal this uh, evening. Next to the Gorge Museum, actually.
Oh my god, look at those small plates of chicken wings. I'm not complaining, I'm not complaining, I'm very, very, very hungry. As you can see, I've already started to destroy those chicken wings while me and Adrian were waiting for their burgers. Those blooming chicken wings were really, really hot, but tasty. My mouth is uh, completely on fire. I hope you liked today's vlog. Remember to subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time. Maybe with a little bit more sunshine. Who knows?